Good morning guys, this is Irish of Pinay Freelancer. Welcome to my vlog. Guys, so it's around 5 in the morning right now. Medyo maga ako nagising. And I woke up to the news as I was checking my Facebook. Ita na si namatay pala si Kobe Bryant guys. Um, crash yung plane helicopter na sinasakyan niya, private helicopter niya as he was on his way to game and the sad thing is kasama niya pa yung eldest niya yata na girl eldest daughter niya so silang dalawa I think total of 5 people nasa sa helicopter yun and Yun, kasama nga si Kobe Bryant. And ito yung pinapakinggan ko ngayon, guys. And if you open your Facebook right now, puro Kobe Bryant post yung makikita mo, guys. Hindi ako fan ng basketball. Hindi rin ako fan niya. But everyone knows yung sino si Kobe Bryant, guys. Diba? Kilala naman natin lahat siya. So, alam mo yun. Masama na feeling, yung parang feeling na. Ito yung news talaga guys. Merong live sa YouTube. Yeah. Yes. That impact you too? Yes. What was it? What was it about Kobe that you admired so much? That he always wanted to help uh, so many people in his life, and he never wanted to stop helping everyone. And your thoughts? You look up there and you see the even the kids were so much affected by that. My friends, man. Carson, I thank you so much you for being here and chatting with us today. Thank you. So, ito yung balita sa YouTube live na ito, guys. Search mo lang yung Kobe Bryant. Ito na yung marami ka na makasinta ang live. Ito yung breaking news kasi kaka-happen yun talaga. As in, meron pang live na pinapakita ay na umuusok yung helicopter. Ito na. Ayan. Ito naman yung area. Kalab, kalab. Ano ba yung area na? Kalabasas. Kalabasas, California. Ayan yung area kung saan nag-crash. Yung plane na sinasakyan niya. Yung helicopter. Ayan. Namusok pa siya. Tapos, ang dami pang nag- Na ano pa nila. So, kaka, this just really happened. Ayan, nunod tayo ng mga layers. Who was so young, so gifted, so wonderful, such a, he was, we all know he's a great basketball player, but he was a better father, husband, and family man. Uh, he did so much in our community that a lot of people really don't know about. We know about the, some of the things that he that he did, but there are stories that I know of of where he has helped personally to help young kids go to school, gave them money to go to school, and I'm not just talking about junior high or high school. I'm talking about college and things like that. He he made the adjustment to retirement better than anyone I've ever met. He uh, he was he was he was you know you always hear about athletes who when they retire they don't know what to do right might be lost or, they get yeah. lost yeah. they're sick their money is stolen yeah. uh, they get into all kinds of trouble and things like that not him he was he was preparing his entire athletic life for when he was going to retire mm -hmm. and when he retired he knew exactly what he was going to do. There was no guessing or anything about it. I, one of the things he became a yell, an author, and one of the books is Legacy and the Queen. And I went down and did and did an interview with him when he talked about that. And one of the so, you guys, this is the sad news, and probably 
most probably kayo din when you open your Facebook yun, wala kayong ibang makikita kundi yung news sa bad Kobe guys so he was really a good person and I'm hindi ko siya hindi ako fan niya hindi ako nagpala sa kanya but you can really feel legend talaga siya so yun lang guys nakakasad yung news this is a devastating news worldwide especially daw dun sa mga taga Los Angeles and I'm sure ito yung magiging laman ng Facebook at ang balita for the next few days so yun lang guys Kobe Bryant he led a really good life at sana he led a really good life na hindi nakaka Oh, Hinaya made use of the life he had, and that's what really I admire about about him. So, sa na natay mo inspire sa life ni guys. Sad news.